Hello FM, today is Tuesday, October 25th, an odd day. I'm Calum. And I'm Danica. And in today's announcements, if you haven't pre-ordered your yearbook yet, you can purchase one for $65 through Monday, October 31st. Order forms are available in Schoology under the SAO checks. Should be made out to FM Schools for $65. All orders received after October 31st will be charged the $70 rate. Zuko will be hosting a blood drive next week on Thursday from 8.30 to 2.30 in the Ox Gym. Donors must be 17 or 16 with a completed Red Cross parent permission slip. All presenting donors will receive a free t-shirt. Sign up in the foyer with the QR code. There will be an ASL meeting today in room 1104 at 215. We will be practicing introductions, spelling our names, and signing snacks. Please bring your ideas for a poem as well. This month's meeting of Girl Up will be on Friday in room 1106. There will be a Halloween party and fundraiser. Be sure to bring a $2 donation and everyone will be entered in raffles to win prizes. All are welcome. There's an improv show at 7 o'clock on Friday, October 28th. Admission is $5 in the black box. Feel free to wear your costume. See you there. FM Diversity Coalition is hosting a Diwali celebration this Thursday in room 1209. Join us to learn about the history of Diwali and enjoy snacks while participating in fun activities relating to this special holiday. Tri-M will be having a mandatory meeting Monday after school in the orchestra room. Please let us know if you can't make it. Hope to see you there. And now over to Caleb. Thanks, Danica. Come to a meeting of the FM International Club during ninth period on Wednesday in room 1207. FM International raises money through games and activities to promote education access around the world. It's fun working for a good cause. Hope to see you there. The FM Observatory is once again looking for high school volunteers to run the fall stargazing event. Volunteers will be asked to help run astronomy-themed stations for elementary school students and their families. The event will run the first clear night on either November 1st, 3rd, 7th, or 8th. If interested, you can sign up with Mr. Meyerhofer in room 2226. Volunteers will earn three service credit hours. Math League will have its first meet after school on Tuesday. All members should be in the cafeteria by 2.15. Please see Mrs. Bishop in room 2114 before Tuesday if you have any questions about the meet. Come to the Varsity Bowling preseason meeting at 2.15 p.m. today in the orchestra room, 1146, for more information. German Club is having a shortened meeting this week in room 2204 after school. We will take our yearbook photo and make plans for lip dub as well as our Krampus activity. All are welcome. Spanish Club will be hosting a Dia de los Muertos event next Wednesday, November 2nd, in Miss Campy's room, room 2214. We'll be watching a movie, eating snacks, and having a discussion. Hope to see you there. You may have seen that the new Dance Marathon MCs have been chosen for this year. Dance Marathon is an annual student council event, this year led by President Catherine Brady, that raises money for a great cause. Here's Scott Hills with another episode of Hot Things. Hey FM, welcome back to episode two of Hot Things. I'm Scott and I'm here today with student council president Catherine Brady. Welcome Catherine. Thank you. Are you ready for this? Yep. Are you gonna be able to handle the spice today? Mm -hmm. All right, let's get right into it then. Okay, so our first chip, <laughs> spicy. Dorito, you can see it's pretty red. Are you ready? Yep. All right, let's take our first bite. Not too bad. All right, Catherine, tell us a little bit about um, Dance Marathon because you know a lot of the freshmen and other students that are new here might not know what DM is. So tell us a little bit about it. Okay, Dance Marathon is for Camp Good Days on Cuca Lake, and it's a camp for kids with cancer and sickle cell anemia. Mm -hmm. And every year we try to raise $100,000 to send as many kids to camp as possible. Awesome. Yeah. Okay, so let's go into our second chip then. <laughs> okay. This is a Taki, maybe? All right. It's a little spicier. Mm -hmm. Do you like it though? Yeah. You like spice? All right, Catherine. So with DM, we have the 14 senior MCs every year. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us a little bit about the MCs and like when they're going to be announced and what they do? Uh, they actually got announced last night. Really? Yeah. Oh my gosh. That's awesome. Yeah. Um, oh, looks like we have some of them right here. <laughs> hey! Hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> Like, what do they do? They fundraise as much money as possible for Dance Marathon. <laughs> Sorry, <that's not> <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Um, okay, well, let's wrap this up with our last chip. This is a oh. another spicy Taki Cheeto thing. Um, this is supposed to be our spiciest one. Do you think it is? Yeah. yeah? 
All right. So we didn't have a homecoming dance this year, mm -hmm. but, whew, sorry, a little spicy. <laughs> you don't think so? Okay, let's take another bite then. <laughs> Eat the whole thing. Eat the whole thing. Oh, the whole okay. Thing. Okay. We're having a winter formal though. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us a little bit about winter formal? When's that going to be? It's what on should students expect? <laughs> <laughs> it's on December 9th, and its theme is Winter Wonderland. Aw, that's adorable. Yeah. So it's a semi formal. Awesome. Okay. Thank you so much, Catherine. Um, this has been episode two of Hot Things. What did you think? It was good. Not too bad? No. You liked it? All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us, Catherine. That's all we have for today. I'm Scott. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's all we have for today. I'm Caleb. And I'm Jenica. Have, have a, a great, great day, day FM. FM.